Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi. Hello. Hi, can you hear me? Yes. Good. Oh, I only have ladies. Nice. Mm. I have Rosalba, Jasmine, Marcella, and Lisette. And now I have Brian. Okay, can you hear me? Yes. Oh, okay, good. Yes. Yes. All right. So let's wait one second. I want to see how many people we have in this class. Okay, there's more people coming in. Okay, class. Um, hello, my name is David Baltrans. I will be your teacher for this month. Hey, Cordelia, hi. Hi. I remember you, hi. It's, it's good to see you. Hi, teacher. Hey, Yesenia, hi. How hi. are you? I am fine, thank you. This is my first time with you. Yes. Oh, Adriana, hi. she's back. Okay. So we have Yesenia. Uh, yeah. I have Adriana Guardado. We have Lisette Minero. Hi, Adriana, how are you? Okay, I think we have a bad connection. Okay, so um, okay, so let's do this. Let me see. So Yesenia, hello. Hello. Hi. Okay. Um. So today's our first day. It's my first time with you. Can you tell the class a little bit about yourself? Okay. Hi, partner. Hi, teacher. Uh, my name is Yesenia Villalta. I am, I am, uh, I appreciate this time because it's, it's interesting for me to learn or to speak English very well. I don't have more experience. I don't have more knowledge. A little bit, no more. Okay, and what do you do? Um, well, um, at this time, I, I am not working right now because uh, I have two kids. I always try to help or with the homework and because um, we are in, we are staying in home because yeah. it's necessary for us, for my family. Of course. And where are you from? Where do you live? Uh, I am from El Salvador. I live in Ayutuxtepec. Oh, okay. Okay, good, good. All right, um, Lisette, are you there? Minero, Lisette Minero? Yes. Hi. Hi. How are you, Lisette? I'm fine. Um, so can you tell the class a little bit about you? Okay. Well, my name is Lisette. I currently work at uh, Grisal. Um, What's more? Um, Wait, where and is I Agri I, yes? where, where is Agrisal? Sounds familiar. Uh, I work in a building of Plaza Mundo Apopa. The okay, project. But, yes, but Agrisal, Agrisal, what do you, it sounds familiar. 
Um, Torre Futura. Yes. Oh, okay, okay, okay. But 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 you are in a popa. Yes, currently work at a popa. Okay. All right. And where do you live? I live in San Salvador. Oh, so every day you travel to a popa? Yes, every day. Hey, but it, yes or no, it's it's good in this time because there's no traffic. Mm, sometimes it, the traffic is very stressful, but yeah. the, it's normal. Okay, but wait for the public transportation to open. Oh, man. Yes. The traffic will be back. Yesterday, I went to a popa and wow, I was in a popa in 15 minutes. So that was a record. I remember that. Yeah. Okay, and um, are you married or do you have children? No, no, I'm single. Oh, okay, good for you. <laughs> All right, <laughs> you're happy. Yes. I was talking with my previous class that um, wow, I've been I've been in my house for four months for this pandemic, and. I, sometimes I said, man, I imagine if I were single, I would be crazy in this moment because I, I, I would watch TV all day, wake up very late, but I can't because um, I'm married and I have a son. <laughs> um, Rosalba? Hello, Rosalba, are you there? Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you, Rosalba? I'm fine, thank you. Can you tell the class a little bit about yourself? Uh, what? Can you tell the class a little bit about yourself? Tell the class about you. What do you do? Where do you live? I think we lost connection with Rosalba. Marcela, are you there? Yes. Oh, hi, Marcela. Can you tell the class a little bit about the class um, about yourself? Okay. Uh, well, uh, my name is Marcela Lopez. I like people call me or Marcela. Um, I'm 25 years old. I'm really young. I or 20. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I had a dog, a crazy white dog. It's supposed a dog. Uh, yeah, it's it's like my baby, my crazy baby. <laughs> uh, it's supposed it's. Dalmata, but it's all white. Okay, it's a Dalmatian. What? It's a Dalmatian. Yeah, uh, no, uh, it's supposed it is uh, Dalmata, but it's all white. Okay, yeah, but Dalmata in English is Dalmatian. Ah, uh, sorry. No, 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 it's okay. Dalmatian, and uh, let me see. Um, 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 I live in Ciudad Arce. Okay. Um, just that, I don't know. Uh, okay, no, it's good. Do you, do you work, currently work? Yeah, I work in, I work in Tigo. Okay. Where in Tigo? In, um... In Tuscania. Tuscania, wow, and you live in Ciudad Arce, so that's far. Yeah, but luckily I'm working from home. Okay, good. But normally when when you imagine there's no pandemia, you travel every day from Ciudad Arce to yeah, Tuscania. Yeah, I used to travel all the time and I spent about two hours uh, from my home, from where I live to where I work. Two hours to go and two hours and to come. 
Yeah, four hours all day. Wow, four hours yeah. of your life traveling. Oof. Yeah, I used to sleep at the bus, and when some friends saw me, they they wake wake me up or <laughs> used to talk uh, with me about something. So, what time do you normally go in Atigo? At eight in the morning? Mm, yeah, I start working at eight, but when there was no pandemia, I used to wake up at four or five a.m. and to could be there at eight. Now I can wake up at six or seven and start to work at eight or at seven. You wake up at 7.55. No, I can't. It's because I must have all already at 8 because I had the possibility. Okay. But... I work in Google and I go in at 6 in the morning, but I wake up at 5.50. <laughs> so I, I just, I log in and I go back to sleep. What <laughs> I, I, I used to do or I... Yeah, what I used to do is to wake wake up at five. Yeah. Uh, start to open all, everything, and and I let I let some programs uh, that they are start uh, by they they by they they sell, and I could sleep at least thirty minutes more. Yeah, that's true. That's true. All right, thank you. Um, okay. Now we have Jasmine. Are you there, Jasmine? Okay, Brian, are you there, Navarro? Hello. Hi. Brian, can you tell a little bit, uh, the class, a little bit about yourself? Okay. Uh, my name is Brian Navarro. Mm -hmm. I'm from San Salvador. I like to listen to music. I study foreign, uh, foreign affairs. I'm sorry, you study uh, what? Foreign affairs. Affairs. Foreign affairs. Interesting. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, the... I don't worry. <laughs> okay. What music do you like? Hello? What music do you like? Um, pop. A rock. Country. Okay. So you like everything in general. Good. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Um, Yesenia? Sorry. Sorry. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I saw, I thought. No, uh, because I, 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 uh, my kids are, are very surprised. They always try to distract me. And I tell him, I tell, hey, hey, <laughs> take it easy. <laughs> oh, I understand you, believe me. Okay, thank you. Victor, are you there? Hi, good evening. Good evening, Victor. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. So can you tell the class a little bit about yourself? Okay. Uh, my name is Victor Ramirez. I, I work uh, at Digicel and customer support. I'm single. I am 35 years old. I'm working from home, a pandemic. Because of the pandemia. Pandemia, pandemia. See, I work in, at home. Oh, wait, so you work in the Hisel? Yes. Oh, so you have competition here. Yes. Because we have some people here from Digo. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Victor. Um, 
Hi, Diana Chavez. How are you? Hi, how are you? Good. Good to hear from you again. Hi. What's new? Can you tell the class a little bit about yourself? Okay. Well, my name is Diana Chavez. I am 25 years old. I live in San Salvador. I have a little girl baby. And I actually, I don't work, but I study English major in the University of San Salvador. So I am here because I need to improve my English and I need to practice a lot my pronunciation too. So other thing around me is that I like my, I like pop music and I like watch Netflix with my family. I like to watch. Netflix. Okay, good. And what are you watching a special series in this moment? And this moment no. But I so but I watch and dark. Is it good? Everybody's watching dark. Uh, yes, for me it's good, but the other people, I don't know. Because okay. the other people at all and think that the, the series is different about the point of view of the people. But is the series dark? Is the series like really dark? Like it's, it's strange? No. Yeah, it's some strange, but it's oh. fantastic. Oh, okay, good, good. In this moment, I am watching in Netflix, um, Sherlock Holmes. Really? What is it about? Um, about Sherlock Holmes. Do you, do you know Sherlock Holmes? No, I don't know. It, well, Sherlock Holmes is a is a character from the past. He's very famous. He's a detective. Detective. It's really? it, yeah. It's from a book. It's from the past. But this is Sherlock Holmes in modern time. Um, he's he's crazy. Do you know the and big? Do you read that book? Oh yes, yes. Uh, but. Do you know, do you like uh, Big Bang Theory? The TV show Big Bang Theory? Mm, really, I don't like. Oh, okay. But this, no, in, in this, Sherlock Holmes, he's similar to Sheldon. The character, he's, he's, he's very strange. Huh? But it's, it's good, I like it. It's very nice. Okay. And my... My wife is watching Dark Desires or something. But on that. What's the name? Dark Desires. Dark. No, I never. Ah, uh, it's it's. Hear about that? Yeah, it's. I don't like it. Uh. All right, thank you, thank you, Diana. Good to hear from you again. Um, Carla Rodriguez, are you there? Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What's your Thank name? You. My name is David. David. Okay. I like your voice. Oh, thank you. Wow. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> no. uh, okay. Uh, my name is Carla Rodriguez. I'm 34 years old. Okay. I, I work in Tigo. Okay. Good. And I like to practice. Is, um, I like to practice uh, basketball. Nice. Um, and any sports, other sports, uh, for example, uh, CrossFit. Which one's CrossFit? Uh, can you repeat, please? Which one is the CrossFit? I forget. CrossFit is aerobics, no? No, CrossFit is uh, like a um, hit or uh, or gym, but 
is more um, is more hardly. It's harder. 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 Yes. Thank you. Because you need to more uh, what do you say? Uh, fuerza. Strength. Strength. Oh yes, yes, I know. It's more physical, right? Yes. Oh nice. And where do you practice um CrossFit? Um, um man, I I forget it. Uh the gym. Uh, okay. wait, wait. Um a la par de la uca se me ha ido el nombre. I, oh um CrossFit. We're all gym, no. It's not, yeah, but I think I know a gym. Okay. Well, there's a big mosquito. Okay. So, yeah. And what? Where do you work? Do you work? I I I, I remember Valley Sport. Valley. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And do you work? Uh, what? Do you work currently? Uh, yes, I work. In Tigo, right? Yes. In Tuscana too. Me too, yeah. And where do you live? In Santa Tecla. Oh, it's not bad from Santa Tecla to Tuscana, right? I, I wake up uh, maybe uh, 6.30 or 7 a.m. <laughs> but currently, are you going to Tuscana or are you working from home? I work in Tuscana. Okay. I live in Santa Tecla. No, but in this moment, in this moment, are you are you traveling to Tuscana every day and or no? No, I, I I work in my house. Okay, so the building of Tuscana is closed. Yes. Okay. So you work from your house. Okay, good. All right, thank you. All right, Byron, are you there? Hello, teacher. Hi, Byron. How are you? I'm fine. Thanks. Nice Can to meet you. Sir. Nice to meet you, sir. Thank you. Can you tell the class a little bit about yourself? Okay. My name is Byron, and my last name is Villalobos. I was born in here in the Salvador, and I, I, I am 21 years old. I also work as a mechanic helping my dad. Oh, good. Yeah, um, in, <laughs> in my garage. <laughs> oh, very no, but you know that's very good. I mean, a mechanic is a very important job. Yeah, that's true. Um, I I think a, a mechanic is similar to a doctor because you always need a me you always need a mechanic. You ne I mean, like a doctor, you always need a doctor. Yeah, yeah, that's true. It's very important. <laughs> yes. Um, and where do you have your shop? Sorry, teacher, I can hear you more. Uh, could you repeat that more slowly, yeah. please? Yes. Okay, you are a mechanic. So a mechanic works in a car shop. Yeah. Yeah. Class, do you understand what is a car shop? Uh, venta carros. No. No? Taller. Taller. Mm. Oh, yeah. Okay. So yeah. What, so where Working. is your where is your car shop? Uh, in Cojutepeque. Okay. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. Very good. All right. Nice, Byron. Okay. Thanks, Tisha. Okay. Uh, good. Okay. Who is next? I see here Juan Hernandez. Hello, Juan. We can't hear you. <clears throat> okay, I think Juan has a bad connection too. Patty, hi. Hello, teacher. It's a pleasure to see you again. Yeah, me too. Hi, how are you? Very well, thank you. 
how is life treating you? Sorry? How is your life? How, how are you? Ah, it is good um, because uh, I am training harder. Okay. Um, in the gym? No, in my house. Oh, okay. Yeah, the, the, uh, the gym is closed for now. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, so everything okay? N nothing new? Uh, no, everything is okay. Uh, my family, my friends. Yes, I'm, I'm blessed. Very good. Yeah, okay. thank you. All right, class. So, so listen, um, this is what we're going to do. Oh, I'm sorry, hold on. Can please hold on. Um, I will be back with you one. Please hold on. Hi, can you hear me? Yes. yes oh, okay, good. I'm sorry, I don't know what happened sometime. I got a very bad connection. <laughs> okay, um, let's practice something real quick today. Um, we're going to practice how to use frequency adverbs. Do you know what is a frequency adverb? Yes. Well, yes. What, it, what is a frequency adverb? One, or who said yes? Uh, or always, sometimes, okay. usually, um, ever, hardly, hardly ever, never, not hardly ever, never. Okay, good. So, um, what is always? Can you give me an example of always, Yesenia? Uh, okay, I always, I always uh, study English. Okay, home. good. Okay, good. So remember, a frequency adverb is it shows how frequent you do that action. Okay, so a frequency action, uh, a frequency adverb is not necessarily every day. is It's not necessarily when you do it is the frequency when you do that action. For example, okay. I, for it, I always eat, yeah, I okay. always take my dinner. I always eat dinner. Ah, okay. okay, but for example, pupusas. Mm. Do you eat pupusas every day? No, right? No. Okay, good. I don't. Good, but you can say, I always eat my pupusas with tomato sauce. Yes. Ah, okay. See, so you're not talking about that you eat pupusas every day. You're explaining what you do when you eat pupusas. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. don't 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 get confused with this, okay, class? Because some people think that always is every day or you know, and sometimes, no, it's not explaining the frequency. It's explaining how often you do that action. Okay. Yes. Okay, so for example, um, Adriana, can you tell me something you always do? Uh, 
Okay, Victor, can you tell me something you always do? I always, uh, I always eat rice. Um, how do you say? Uh, in lunch. Uh -oh, lunch, sorry. No, that's okay. I, I always eat rice in lunch. Is that correct? I always eat rice in lunch. Victor? Yes. Okay, good. Good. So I always eat rice in lunch. Okay. Lisette, can you tell me something you always do? I always take a shower in the morning. Okay, very good. All right. Okay, that's good. I always take a shower in the morning and at night because it's hot. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Rosalba, are you there? Okay, Marcela, are you there? Yes. Okay, Marcela, do you drink coffee? Yeah, I love coffee. Very good. Okay, tell me something you always do with coffee. I always drink uh, a cup of coffee with, with, and eat um, something sweet. like uh, With sweet I bread. Know. Yeah, with sweet bread. Very good. All right. So you always eat coffee with sweet bread. Yeah, and I like to drink coffee at 3 p.m. is exact cost is something I used to do. Oh man, no. almost do. Oh, I I I drink coffee anytime. I'm, I'm I am a I am a coffee lover. Coffee lover. Yes, I I am really a, a a coffee fan. Sometimes when I go to Burger King or or McDonald's or something, um, and I ask for a combo, and they mm -hmm. ask me. And you drink what you want soda and so can it be coffee and they always look at me strange <laughs> yes if you want coffee okay good i prefer coffee please <laughs> i prefer coffee after it uh for example i eat at the lunch and drink water or soda and after like uh, dessert yes i drink coffee let me see, do you like instant coffee or normal coffee? Um, I prefer normal coffee, but is easily uh, the instant. instant coffee. Yeah, yeah, I don't like instant coffee. <laughs> yeah, I, it's awful, but... It's not coffee. It's what I have. <laughs> yeah, no, no, I understand. You know, sometimes like my family, because they know I love coffee, they give me Folgers or Juan Valdez, but instant. Ah, uh, no, no, it's instant. not the same. Uh, it's not the same. I suppose you had a machine or a, on a French machine. Oh, I have three. <laughs> I, yeah, I have glass, titanium. <laughs> I have very, like, three different coffee makers. Oh, you, you are a really lover, uh, coffee lover. I am, yes. I love coffee. Yes. I, I like to smell. <laughs> Every... Oh, it's the best. When the the, the coffee is um, um, recent tostado, I don't know. Recent, recently toasted. Recently, yeah. You know, in my opinion, in El Salvador, you have coffee cup, um, Starbucks, I don't know why, but the coffee from Mr. Donut and Pollo Campero is very good. I don't like the coffee of Mr. Donut. I love that coffee from Mr. Donut. It's it's very good, but it, I prefer I prefer the coffee of Mr. Donut to um, Starbucks. I don't know why. <laughs> 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 All right, good. So you always eat sweet bread with coffee. Very good. All right. Thank you. Jasmine, are you there? Teacher. Yes. I have a question. Sure, please. How do you say es raro? It's strange. 
eh, example, eh, eh, Raro eats eh, coffee it's, and hamburger. It's strange, coffee and hamburger. It's strange. Oh, oh yes, it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yes. Yes, uh, the reaction of the people and like when they take my order, yeah, I want combo number 2 please. Okay, good. And do you want iced tea or soda? Uh coffee please. And they look at me. Coffee? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <Yeah>. thank you teach. <laughs> okay, cool. All right, um uh who was it? Brian Navarro, are you there? Brian. Hi, Brian. Brian, where where do you live? In Sayapango. Okay. Brian, uh, who do you live with? How? Huh? Who do you live with? I live with, with. with. I live with. with my son. I live with my wife. Wife now. No, who do you live with? With your family? Uh, okay, Brian, you live in Soyapango, correct? Yeah. Yeah. Only you, no family. With family. I'm sorry? Uh, with family? There, with. Um, my father's. With Okay, so who do you live with? I live with my fathers. Yeah. So you have two fathers? No. <laughs> my father and my mother. Oh, okay, so you live with your parents. Parents. Yes. Uh, see. Yeah. Um, I understand why you say fathers, Brian, because Spanish, Spanish is very sexist. Do you know what is sexist? Es que le estoy escuchando cortado y como que no. Todos me oyen cortado. No. No. No, está bien. Okay. It's raining in, in Soyapango, Brian? Okay, bueno, do you know, class, do you know what is sexist? Uh, it's like, um, I don't know how to say it, but there's more important men, or something like that. Yes, imagine, imagine I say, men are superior than women. M women only cook and clean so i am sexist what is sexist like machismo exactly exactly okay so brian said my father's and i was explaining to brian that that is not correct because a spanish is very sexist always goes to the to the male mis amigos mis papas mis tios mis abuelos it's always the men and in english you can't say that mis hijos you know in english there's always one name there's one for for the two so for example my parents that means my mother and father. Okay, do you understand? My friends, boys or girls. My children, boy or girl. So you don't say my sons. Only if you have sons. For example, Yesenia, you have two children. Yes, I have two. A boy and girl or two boys or two girls? Um, and boys and girl. Okay, so in Yesenia, in her case, she says, I have two children. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I have to. Mm -hmm. 
But normally in Spanish, Yesenia would say, tengo dos hijos. Mm -hmm. uh, le, le pregunta a Yesenia, ¿tiene hijos? Sí, dos. But if you say that, uh -huh. but if you listen, hijos, nunca digo hija. But mm -hmm. in Spanish, you understand. But in English, it's children because hay siempre una palabra neutra. Okay? Okay. All right, so uh, Demi, are you there? Patricia Amaya, are you there? Yes, teacher. Hi, I'm Patricia. Here. Good. Patricia, where do you live? I live in Lourdes, La Libertad. Who, yeah, who do you live with? With my two kids. And where do you work? Uh, I'm not work. I don't work. Oh yeah, you don't work in this morning. Patricia, can you tell me something yeah. you always do in Christmas? Um, Christmas, I always visit my family. Okay. Very good. And okay. you always, always visit your family, right? Yes, always. All right, good. Thank you. Jonathan. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. <laughs> Hello, teacher. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello, Jonathan. Jonathan, can you tell me what is something a Salvadorian person never eats? No, never. I'm sorry. Um, never use with a pupusa. Oh. The Salvadorian people never use... Uh, I never use a fork. Fork, oh, yes, fork or knife. And knife. Okay. <laughs> With, the proposal. With the proposal. Good. So, yeah, you always say the oh, Salvador. Yeah. The Salvador the always, always use the, the hands, the fingers. For the, the fingers for it, the pupusa. All right, good, yes. A Salvadorian always uses the fingers to eat pupusas, never uses fork or knife. It's more delicious. With, with what, with fingers? With finger, it eat pupusas. Oh yeah, of course, yes. It's a traditional thing. Yeah, yes, it's true. Me, only one time in my life, I ate pupusas with a fork and knife. Really? When? Um, I was in a wedding. I, I went to a, a, a party, uh, a wedding. Mm -hmm. And that day, I was wearing a suit, mm. a tuxedo. Okay. And I had to be very, very careful because, you know, it's greasy and I touch my yes. shirt. So I, I <laughs> only that day, or, but I. Or you can, or you can use four. You can use a four when you are working in front of the computer and you, you uh, don't, don't take care. Don't took the computer with your hand if you eat pupusa in your home. Yes, you that's take true. <laughs> yeah, that's another one. <laughs> it's for only necessary thing. Yes, it's true. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Um, so, Rafael Escobar, are you there? Herbert, are you there? Uh, hello, teacher. Here oh, I hi, am, Rafael. Rafael. Hi, Rafael. Uh, hi. Uh, hi, how are you? I'm fine. Thank you. And Good. Rafael, can you tell me what is something you never do? in your house? Uh, uh, <laughs> um, I, let me see. Um, maybe, maybe cook. You never cook? Uh, no, I don't like it cook. 
Okay, good. Who cooks in your house? Sorry? Who cooks in your house? Uh, my wife. She my always... wife and, and, and um, or my, my children. Okay, they always cook? Yes. Oh, okay. They do. All right, good. Herbert. Oh, I'm sorry, I already spoke to Herbert, I think. Hello. Hi, Herbert. Hi. Herbert, can you tell me something you never eat? Hmm. But, 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 but please don't say I never eat monkey. No. No, no. I, like... I, I, I love, I, I love all, all the, all the food. Really, maybe I don't eat, for example, chocolate. You don't eat chocolate. Ooh. Yeah, it's re yeah. yeah, because uh, it's 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 bad for me, it's for for health. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, good. I love chocolate. Oh man, if the doctor tells me. Yeah, I love too, but I have a a condition. Yeah, no, I I imagine. Yeah. <laughs> No, but I imagine it must be difficult because if sometimes a doctor tells me, David, you need to stop drinking coffee, I would say, oh, man. Yeah, but uh, but it's difficult. It is, I imagine. Mm. All right, so you never, you never eat chocolate? Yeah. Okay, or drink? No, nothing. Okay, good. Luis Lemus, are you there? Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. All right. Le uh, Luis, can you tell me something you never do in your house? In my house, in my parents, is my wife in my son? Mm, no, but tell me something you never do. Never do. No, no, understand. Let me give you an example. For example, me in my house, I never smoke. Well, and normally I never smoke, but especially in my house, I never smoke in my house. I never smoke. Yeah, tell me something you never do. What was that? Um, Luis, tell me something you never do in your house. In in my house. Yes. And I I work in the in my house. Okay, um, Lu Luis, in your house, do you have parties? And they have parties. Example. Luis, in your house, do you have parties? Do you drink liquor? Do you smoke all day? I drink. Okay, do you understand what is never? I drink coffee. Okay. Do you, in your house, Luis, in your house, do you do you have parties? Parties. Do you listen to Bad Bunny in full volume? No, no, never. No. Do you listen to bachata music in full volume? Ah, uh, music. Luis, ¿qué es algo que nunca hace en su casa? What is okay. something you never do in your I house? I never, I never in my house is uh, smoke. Mm, I. Casi todo, ¿no? <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> 
Wow, no quisiera I, ser su I vecino dancing. porque... No. I never dance. Ok, good, good. I never dance in my house. Yo pensé que me iba a decir otra cosa, porque casi todo hago. Yo. Oh, man, no lo quisiera tener de vecino. Ok, okay good, I never dance. Ok, good. Um, Brenda, are you there? Yes, teacher. Brenda, what is your favorite food? Um, difficult. Uh, my favorite food is. I don't. No sé el nombre. Chow mein. You like chow mein? Yes. I love chow mein. Me too. <laughs> okay. Um, what do you never mix with chow mein? Um. Um, with, I don't know, beans? Be yeah, that's true, beans. Okay, so, <laughs> yeah, it's good. I never mix beans with chow mein. Yes, I never mix Okay, beans. but with chow mein. Okay, good. All right, Carla, are you there? Carla. Yes, I am. How are you, Carla? I'm fine. Um... Carla, what do you like? Um, what, what music do you like? What music? Um, what well, music? Actually, actually, tell me what music do you never listen to? I never listened. Um, eh, ¿Cómo se le dice? Corridos. Narco, corridos. Me, narco, Mexican, Mexican. Okay. Music. <laughs> you don't. Okay, good. So, yeah, you never listen to. Uh, f that would be what? Folk music? Mexican folk music. Mexican folk music. Um, maybe. No, maybe no, because remember, never is like really never. No, uh, I, I try to say. Um, like, for example, me too. I, I don't like corridos, but. I like Tigres del Norte sometimes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but, I, I hate I hate it, this music. Yeah, me too. Me too. I don't like it. I don't, but some Tigres del Norte songs are okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes. Okay. Okay, but for example, in me, I never, never, ever listen to reggaeton. Mm, reggaeton is sometimes is uh, funny <laughs> yeah oh <laughs> not for me reggaeton if my if my son plays reggaeton music no baby out out my house <laughs> <laughs> no it's okay all right claudia sanchez are you there hi teacher hi do you like eggs excuse me do you like eggs? Yes, I like eggs. Yes. So, yes, I like eggs. Yes, I like eggs. Can you tell me something you always put on your eggs? Um, I I cook um, huevo estrellado. <laughs> ¿Cómo se dice? No, no. So what is something you always put? Que siempre le pone. Ah, yeah. Um, tomato. Uh, cebolla, ¿cómo se dice? Onion. Onion. I, I like more onion. Oh, me too. I love onion. Um, onion. I always, I always put, onion. I always put ketchup on my eggs. What? I always put ketchup on my eggs. I like ketchup on the egg. Uh, I always put uh, onion and salt. Oh, okay. Okay, good. So listen, class, tomorrow, tomorrow, just, yes. I have a question. Please, uh, go ahead. Uh, can you repeat the question that you told uh, uh, she? 
for example, to for Claudia? example you said, uh -huh, Claudia, you said, where is the something do you put? No, I said, what is something uh, you always put on your eggs? Uh, okay. Okay. Because, Thank you. Yeah, some, sometimes people, they always put salt and pepper. Yeah. Bacon. Bacon. Yeah, some people always put bacon. Well, no, uh -huh. yeah, because I I couldn't hear the question exactly. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, no, no problem. It's but, good. Okay, thank you. So, but listen, so tomorrow, this is what we're going to do. We're going to practice the question and the answer, okay? Because the question is usually how often? It's like, hey, how often do you go to the beach? I sometimes go to the beach. I never go to the beach. I always go to the beach. Okay. Or, for example, what is something you never do in in downtown San Salvador? Do you know what is downtown San Salvador? Yes. In the center of San Salvador? Yeah. Uh -huh. So you say to people, man, in downtown San Salvador, you never walk with gold. Or you never walk with your cell phone. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> with your iPhone. Okay. So that, that's actually what we're going to practice tomorrow. We're going to, um, <clears throat> we're going to do questions with how often or what do you never, what do you always, what do you sometimes do? Yes? Okay. Okay, so for example, when you eat pupusas, what do you always put in the pupusa? Tomato sauce. Tomato sauce, encurtido or no? Uh, no, it's bad for my health. <laughs> oh, okay. In San Miguel, people always put uh, mayonnaise curtido. Uh, really? Yeah. Many and people it, say, uh, say that pupusas are very delicious with mayonnaise. Yes, it's good. In, I like it. But in my really? case, it's, re, it's stranger. But I, but I never uh, test them like this. I lived in San Miguel two years, and I remember my first experience with pupusas. And I said, "Excuse me, do you have curtido?" And oh yeah, and and they gave me like a picnic salad like a campero yeah yeah mm, yes okay one day i will buy this kind of salsa uh, this kind of curtido well, well there are I... there are two there are two there are like a campero type and there's mm -hmm. a curtido curtido but no vinegar is mm -hmm. mayonnaise mayonnaise okay mm -hmm. And I it's, it's, it's not tomato sauce, it's black sauce. Really? Yeah. So I was, wow, what is this? Like but, I, I, but I liked it. I, it was very good. I, I liked it. <laughs> but yeah, but people always put, and in, 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 they always put, um, Mayonnaise in the curtido. But I, but I can do the same curtido. I think I prepared the sauce, and salad. Sal Come on, how do you say a salad mm -hmm. with the mayonnaise? And mm -hmm. I, and I can buy two pupusas and I yeah. taste them. Yeah, try it. It's good. It's very like good. Like San Miguel. <laughs> uh, oh man, now I am hungry. <laughs> okay, class, so thank you very much. Okay, hoy solo quería oír cómo hablaban como para conocernos. Eh, ya mañana empezamos bien. Vamos a empezar con los adverbios de frecuencia. O sea que eh, si mañana pueden ir estudiando never, usually, seldom, vamos a hacer cómo, cómo hacer preguntas en frecuencias y las respuestas. Ok, okay, 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 teacher. okay, teacher. okay, teacher. okay. Yes. Hay un grupo en WhatsApp. Uh -huh. eh, no sé para agregarnos ahí. Oh, ok, um, si gustan, es, les voy a dar mi número. Ah, ok.
Ahí está mío. Me agregan y, y hacemos Ajá. un grupo. Mismo el enlace. Ajá. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. So thank you very much. Have a great day. ¿Y what is your number? Ah, in the chat. It's in the chat. Eh, let me, ah, okay. Thank you, teacher. All right, no problem. Send me a WhatsApp, no problem. Okay. Yo me yo me duermo a la una de la mañana anyway, so. No. <laughs> oh, no. wow. Okay. I have insomnia. Yeah. Uh, you you must drink uh, tea, manzanilla tea with lemon and honey. Oh, no. <laughs> no drinking coffee. This is a reason. <laughs> This is my coffee cup. This is a reason that you can sleep very well during the night. No, no, it's, you know what, it's, it's not coffee. The problem is that now, last week and this week, in the afternoon, I sleep maybe two or three hours. Um, I, I, and eso me controlo. That's, okay, that's so yeah, that because it's necessary you sleep eight hours. That's... Yes, it's necessary, but that's the problem that now I sleep in the afternoon a little bit and at night I'm not sleepy. <laughs> so <laughs> I, I need to stop sleeping in the afternoon. Okay. <laughs> okay, class. Thank you very much. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Tomorrow, bye. -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.